Welcome to another episode of Advanced Excel for Visually Impaired by Accessible Computing YouTube channel. Accessible Computing Access to Technology with Accessibility. This session will be interesting to you because today we will learn how can you sort in MS Excel. Let's start. I have a data with 19 names and other details. So let me check what are the details in my data. Name. Rename A1. Name. I am pressing right arrow. Region B1. Region. I am pressing right arrow. Current salary C1. Current salary. So, so I have added three columns. One is name. Second region. Third is salary. Now. There are 19 names. Just listen one by one. Rename name Pradal Makar GA2, Rajiv Biswas A3, Kunal Sai A4, Riyad Daz A5, Anish Chowdhury A6, Rajat Alder A7. I hope you have already understood that there are lots of names but not organized. First name is Pratul. Second name is a three Kunal Rajiv Pradal Mukherjee A Rajiv Biswas A three Rajiv Biswas. Third name is Kunal Sa A four Kunal Sa. It's not organized. Like first the name starts with P, then next name starts with R, then next name starts with K. So to organize your data in a thoroughly manner from A to Z or Z to A. You have to use the feature called sort in MS Excel. With sort, you can organize your data from A to Z or Z to A or smallest to largest or largest to smallest. And also you can apply multiple sort options. In this video, I will show you everything. First of all, I want to make the list from A to Z. It is very easy to find any name or easy to find uh, any data from our huge data list. To apply sort, you have to go to the column headers. I have already told you what is the column headers. Raj of Prat name A1. Name. So I want to sort by name because I want to see the name list from A to Z. Focus column headers and then press application key. Cut, cut, remove the selection and put it on the... Now I'm pressing down arrow till I will get the sort options. Copy, copy, paste option, paste, spec, smart, look up, insert, hit, delete, delete, clear, content, translate, tra quick analysis, Q, filter, collapse, D, sort, collapse, O. Sort collapsed means there is a sub menu options. If I press right arrow, sort A to Z, sort A to Z, lowest to highest S. It's simple. If I click or press enter here, sort A to Z, the sort will be applied in my data. Let's see what are other options. I'm pressing down arrow. Sort Z to A, sort Z to A, highest to low. Sort Z to A means it's a descending order. Put selected cell color on top C. It's cell color, which means the sort will be applied depending on the cell colors. I'm not going to discuss this. Put selected font color on top F. Font color. Put selected formatting icon on top F. Formatting icon. Custom sort, custom sort, choose more options. I will come the comes custom sort later. Now I'm pressing down arrow again. Sort A to Z, sort A to Z, lowest to high. Now I'm pressing enter here. Let's see. Demo.xlsxxl, sheet one table, name A1. Now I'm pressing down arrow. Listen very carefully. Anish Chowdhury A2, Anita Kumari A3, Debjit Baumik A4, Dip Chakraborty A5, Eldo K Abraham A6, Kidu Daz A7, Kunal Sai A8, Lalu Sai A9. Okay, so every name is now in an order, ascending order. First, all the names starts with A, 
then the next letter then the next letter then the next letter okay also the others data has been sorted i mean Anish Choudhury, the data of Anish Choudhury has been sorted in first column. It is not mandatory or it is not required to change every column's data. Because once you have applied sort in one column, others column will be adjusted. Okay. I hope you can understand. Still, if you have any queries, you can ask me into the comment section. Now, I am going to tell you how to do smallest to largest and largest to smallest. Name A1. For this, I am going to column salary. Reach current salary C1. Current salary and I am pressing application key followed by Cut, cut, remove the selection uh, and put options. it on the copy. Spencer, delete, clear, tran, quick, filter, sort, collapse, to. Sort options. Sort A to Z, sort A to Z, lowest to highest, S. Sort Z to A, sort Z to A, highest to lowest, O. So if I click on Z to A, which means Z to A, it's the descending order, then let's see what will happen. Demo.xlsxxl, sheet one table, current salaries, current salary cell C1. I am pressing down arrow here. 25,000 C2. 25,000. 23,500 C3. 23,500. Okay. 21,000 C4. 20,000 C5. Let's see the Current corresponding data. 25,000. 25,000. East B. Lalu Sa A2. C. Before it's Anish. Now it's Lalu. Why? Because I have applied only the current salary column that's why the correspond data also adjusted it's very helpful feature for us now i am going to show you advanced sort or custom sort because the course is advanced excel before this i want to show you another column name a region b1 region Region means I have listed some region like South, North, East. Okay. Current salary to North B2. North. North B3. North. South B4. South. East B5. East. South B6. South. East B7. East. South B8. South. East B9. West B10. West B. South B. South B. South B. North B5. West B16. Region. Okay. Name A1. Now suppose I want to know. Okay. So, I want to get the least name from A to Z, region from Z to A, and current salary from lowest to highest. Is it possible? Yes, it's possible. Now, let's see how to do it, how to apply multiple criteria in sort. Okay, I'm in first column, right? Now, I'm pressing application key and go to sort submenu cut cut remove the sort a to z sort I'm pressing a to up arrow custom sort custom sort I'm pressing choose enter more here. options sort dialog sort window ok button sort dialog sort window ok button ok first of all I have to apply my first criteria now I'm pressing tab cancel button add level button alt plus a I'm telling in details what is add level uh, a few minutes later delete copy left options but alt plus o just press tab tab my data has headers checkbox checked alt plus h yes my data has header you have to check this checkbox otherwise it will not work properly data grid column header item data grid column header item sort field data item one of one sort by data item row one column column one sort by yes sort by when it says sort by now you have to choose your column header first criteria to choose your column header to choose column header you have to use up arrow key and down arrow key i am pressing down arrow here name expanded yes i want to sort first name wise that's why I have kept my focus on name. 
Then I press tab. Collapsed. Sort on data item row one. Sort on column two. Sort on combo box cell values. Collapsed. Yes, cell values. There are two to three options if you want to sort with cell values. Values means what in the cell, like uh, if there's numbers or letters. Okay, so you have to choose cell value. You can choose any other options from the combo box by using up arrow and down arrow key. Cell values expanded. So I'm keeping my focus to cell value then press tab collapsed order data item row one order column three order combo box a to z collapsed now order combo box which means you have to tell the excel okay i have selected my column headers is row sorry name um i want to sort by cell values and my cell value is a to z okay i mean ascending orders a to Z expanded. Yes, I have selected A to Z by pressing down arrow key. Now I am pressing tab. Collapsed. OK button. Don't click on OK button. I am pressing tab. Cancel button. Add level button. Alt plus A. Yes, I need to add a new level. OK, I am pressing enter here. Now a new level was added. I am pressing tab. Delete level button. Alt Delete plus level. E. Copy level button. Alt Copy plus level. E. Move up the options. My data has headers. Checkbox checked. Alt plus H. Yes, this checkbox must be checked. Data grid. Column header item. Data grid. You don't need to do this. Just press tab. Sort field data item two of two. Tab. Then by data item row two column column yes, one. Yes, this is then by. So when you have applied the first sort condition then here you will not get sort by you will get then by which means you have to select the second criteria now i am pressing down arrow key blank expanded list box list name name i have already applied the criteria with name so i am skipping i'm pressing down arrow again list box list region region yes i want to apply criteria on region that's why I'm keeping my focus on region and then press tab. Demo.xlsxxl unavailable. Sort dialog. Sort window. Data grid. Sort field. So now there is also sales value. I'm choosing sales value. Cell values expanded. Yes. Now I'm pressing tab again. Collapsed. Order data item row order, order data column three. A to Z. A to Z. Expand list box list. Z to A. Z to A. List box list. Custom list. Custom list, if I want to do any others custom list, I can do. But I list want to... List box list, okay. at a Z. A to Z. Right? Now I'm pressing tab again. Demo.xlsxxl unavailable. Sort dialog. Sort window. OK button. And now I want to add another level. Cancel add level button. Alt plus A. OK. So I have added the th third level and now I want to apply the third level criteria what is what will be my criteria my criteria is okay let's do i'm pressing tab delete copy move up button move up options but my da data grid call my data as headers checkbox checked alt plus h i'm telling again this checkbox must be checked data sort field data item th then by data item row three then column, by column. so i'm choosing from blank then list by box li list box list region List box list current salary. Current salary, yes, because I have already applied uh, sort conditions on name and region. Now I want to apply the sort conditions on current salary. So I'm pressing tab. Demo dot sales value. Cell values. Ex now I'm pressing tab. Collapsed. Order data item row three. Order column three. Order, order data. Smallest to largest. Expanded. Smallest to largest because there are numbers in. Uh, salary or current salary columns there are numbers only na? there are no data like a to z so that's why smallest to largest or largest to smallest list so, box list largest to smallest i am choosing largest to smallest so i have already chosen largest to smallest now let me tell you what are the criteria i have set for name i have set ascending criteria a to z for region I want to set ascending criteria A to Z and the third criteria which I have applied is 
salary current salary which is largest to smallest excel will show me name a to z region a to z and salary largest to smallest so i'm clicking on okay demo.xlsxxl okay button for demo.xlsxxl let's see it's work or not name a1 name i'm pressing down arrow anish choudhury a2 yes anish choudhury anita kumari a3 anita kumari debjit pao dip chakra bordi a feldo k kiru da kunal sa kiru da name a1 okay so name is i i i hope it's okay so i'm going to region again region b1 Let's see. North B two. North. North B three. North. South B four. South. East B five. East. South B six. South. East B seven. South B eight. Okay. So sometimes Read. it not it's not be works. So what you need to do is just clear all sorts and then apply again. You can try it out. Current salary C one. Let's see current salary. Twelve thousand five hundred C two. Twelve thousand five hundred. Fifteen thousand C twenty three thousand fourteen thousand ten thousand five twelve thousand three hundred twelve thousand C eight. Okay, it's working. But sometimes you you may have missed one or two conditions. So what you need to do just uh, apply again. by clearing all the sorts how to how to clear let me tell you read name a1 i'm in the column name cut cut remove the sort data cut put selected form put put sort sort data z sort collapse stop demo okay just what you need to do is uh press control plus z to undo Quick and now. then demo. add again Opa. demo dot xls admins apply again so this is for today I hope you have understood what what I have taught in this tutorial. Still if you have any query, any questions regarding this video or regarding this session, feel free to ask into the comment section. In the next video we are going to discuss about filtering in MS Excel. So next video will be also very very interesting. Don't forget to subscribe this channel and don't forget to like this video. because your like your support your subscribe and your share is very very helpful for me to make new videos to make uh new ideas okay so it's free of cost so don't forget to subscribe and share and like the video if you want to connect with me in instagram my instagram profile will be shared in the first comment and also if you want to connect us in telegram group so join our telegram group the link is in the description box thank you for watching this video see you in the next episode till then stay safe take care bye bye